I'm Danelle Herzing, nursing student. I'm going to be taking care of you today. Perform hand hygiene, provide privacy. Can you tell me your name and date of birth? Okay, great. So what I'm going to do today is do your cardiovascular assessment. Essentially, um, look at your chest, um, listen to your heart sounds, look at your arms for some swelling, as well as your legs, and um, feel your pulses in a few places. Is that okay? Okay, perfect. Let me put some gloves on here. Now, um, have you been having any type of chest pain? No? Good. Have you been having any cough or shortness of breath that you've noticed? Good. Have you noticed any swelling in your lymph nodes or on your arms or legs? Okay, great. And does your family have a history of um, lymphatic issues? No, good, good. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm going to feel your carotid on one side. Good, and the other side. Always wanting to do one side at a time. Good. Let me grab my stethoscope real quick. Now I'm gonna listen to your carotid artery one side at a time. Good, and the other side. Good. Now I'm gonna look at your chest here, um, looking for your apical pulse, making sure that I'm not able to see any abnormalities on the outside before actually listening to you. And I'm going to feel your apical pulse between your fourth and fifth rib. Looks good and feels good to my, uh, palpation on my finger and I don't notice any lifts or heaves that are abnormal um, which is what we would list or look for for abnormalities. Now I'm going to listen in between now what I'm listening for is an what we call an S1 and an S2 going in a Z type pattern Good. The S1 and S2 is when your chambers, um, your atrium, and your ventricle are relaxing and pulsating at different times. Now I'm going to have you roll onto your left side so I can listen for any um, what we call an S3 or an S4. Essentially it's a gallop or a murmur. Good. Now, whenever you go on your back, I'm going to do the same thing to listen to you with my bell side. Good. And you haven't been diagnosed with a murmur before that you've been told. Good. I didn't hear anything on my side either. Now the last thing that we want to do is feel all 10 of your lymph node areas coming from your pre occur occur occur. Sorry, I cannot pronounce that today. All the way down to your supra clavicle area. Go down to your occipital area, keep going. Everything feels good, looks good, and sounds good. Do you have any questions or concerns for me today? I didn't feel anything abnormal, didn't hear anything abnormal, didn't see anything abnormal, so everything looks good there. Now the last thing that I wanna go ahead and do is look at your arms. I don't see any swelling. I want to feel your pulses here on your radial side. 
as well as the ulnar side. Feels good. And now I want to look at your legs. Again, looking for any swelling, any abnormalities that you might notice. Feel your pulses, your popliteal pulses, femoral pulses, and pedal pulses. You have no swelling, no pitting edema that I've seen. Good. So everything's looking good and checking out. I appreciate it. I will give you your call light, put the bed back down in lowest position, wash my hands, and unless you need something else, I will see you later. Thank you.